Prince Harry and Prince William will have to make concessions if they are both to attend a key event in the coming months, according to a royal author. Prince Harry may be planning to travel back to the UK in June to attend some of the much-anticipated events marking the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. If he decided to do so, the Duke of Sussex would likely find himself shoulder to shoulder with his brother, according to royal commentator Katie Nicholl. This would provide the pair, whose relationship has been at the center of speculation and discussions for months, the occasion to iron out their differences or at least come to a cordial agreement, according to Ms. Nicholl. She told OK. Magazine, Harry will want to be a part of the celebratory weekend in June, and will almost certainly be required to appear with William at that time. It seems to me that both brothers will have to make concessions. They didn't seem to find an opportunity at Prince Philip's funeral last April to talk properly, but the Jubilee should give them more of a chance to thrash it out one to one. Prince Harry relocated to California with his family at the end of March 2020, as he and Meghan were bowing out of their senior royal roles. The Duke has since travelled to England twice, once in April to attend Prince Philip's funeral and another time in late June. On that occasion, he attended an event hosted by one of his most beloved patronages, Wellchild, at Kew Gardens. On the following day, July 1st, he headed to Kensington Palace to unveil the statue of Princess Diana him and Prince William commissioned in 2017. Harry was seen leaving the grounds of his former residence shortly after the ceremony had ended. Following months of speculation and rumors of a rift between the brothers, Harry first about the state of his bond with William in October 2019. Interviewed by Tom Bradby for the documentary Harry Meghan, An African Story, the Duke famously said he and William will always be there for one another but they are on different paths. Two years later, following claims the Duke of Cambridge had been left furious in early 2020 by Harry and Meghan's decision to change their royal status, the Duke of Sussex spoke with Oprah Winfrey about his relationship with William in similar terms. Asked about his relationship with William, Harry said, you know, as I've said before, I love William to bits. He's my brother. We've been through hell together. I mean, we have a shared experience. But we, you know, we're on different paths. Prince Harry also spoke about his bond with his father, saying he was feeling really let down. He continued, he knows what pain feels like, and this is. And Archie's his grandson. But, at the same time, you know, I, of course I will always love him, but there's a lot of hurt that's happened. And I will continue to make it one of my priorities to try and heal that relationship. The Duke mentioned his upbringing and his relationship with Charles also in two other occasions in May 2021, first when appearing on the podcast Armchair Expert and then in the mental health series he co-created with Ms. Winfrey, The Me You Can't See. Ms. Nichol said that, much like with William, if Harry returned for the Jubilee he would need to look Charles straight in the eyes if there are any issues to be solved. She said, it's the same with Prince Charles, Harry is going to have to meet his father and look him straight in the eye if their issues are to be fixed. Prince Harry hasn't yet announced whether he will travel back to the UK in the coming months for the service of Thanksgiving to be held in March as a tribute to Prince Philip or for the Jubilee celebrations.